Good evening. Happy Monday. You better wrap up warm chat. It's gonna be pretty cold today. I don't know actually, I didn't do the metals, but I can imagine it's gonna be pretty uh pretty nippy out there. Hopefully everyone is well. At least the worst day of the week's over, right? And hopefully, for some of you, it's the last Monday you're working this year. I mean, some of you might work next Monday, to be fair, but... Hi! How are we? Hello. Uh, it is summer, but we're, like, gonna be, like, near the South Pole, right? So, I feel like near the South Pole, it's cold whatever season of the year, no? I don't know. Um, Antarctic Airways Penguin. It looks so adorable. Um, hi everybody. Hello. There's so many of you here. Can we get hellos in chat? Why is my sister just WhatsApp me? The timing. I'll reply to you later, Alice. Um, hello everybody. Sk uh, Skipple's here. We've got Shane. We've got Pro Pilot Damien. Uh, Sir Mr. Whippy. Hello. I've not worked since bonfire night. What? You not worked for four and a bit weeks, you lucky, lucky person. Um, poor Alice. Yeah, sorry, Alice. You have to wait a few hours now. Uh, ow. Um, <laughs> flying for how you mango. Hello, Danny. Hello, Chaos is here as well. Hello, Mrs. Clans here. Um, we got Craig in the building. Aaron, Adam, Rev, Jersey Pilot. Uh, Fly by Wire, James. Good evening. Hello, Zach's here. Callum's here. Um, Spider Max is here. Asmid, good evening. Hello, Liam. Hi. Um, I only got two more Mondays to go. There's only three left in the... Yeah, there's only... If I say there's only three, three, three Mondays left of the year. Um, two weeks today is the day... Two weeks today is Christmas Eve Eve. Think about that for a minute. It's pretty insane. Cameron, good evening. How are you? Mick, uh, Meek as well. Hello, how are you? Uh, Rock, hello. Good evening. Lilo, good evening. Um, guys, if you've messaged me on Discord, I've not got back to anybody pretty much. So apologies. Um, I've literally been wrapping up Christmas presents for a majority of today. Um, I didn't realize or didn't quite understand that, you know, the more presents you buy, the more you have to wrap up and the longer it takes. Um, I literally spent maybe probably four hours today wrapping presents obviously all for you guys um so i'll be putting postage labels on them soon and shipping them out to you uh <laughs> yeah that exactly mrs clan i did wrap that one up today <laughs> uh, michael good evening how are you hello um the job i do is in the title uh, oh you're an ice cr oh that makes sense we run a family-run ice cream van business we don't stop back up until the end of march i love that I love that. What do you do during the winter then? Just relax? Or do you have like another job you do during the winter? I've never really thought about ice cream workers. Because they, they, they probably can't really make much money when it's cold outside, can they? Uh, nothing through the post jersey, no. So, according to Royal Mail, the PO box should be open tomorrow. But th they said they'll send me the PO box details through... through uh, it makes sense why they're sending it through the post. But... Uh, yeah, haven't heard anything from them yet. Uh, Josh, good evening. How are you? Hello, my voice is already going. That's not good enough. Adam, I've got no idea. Uh, guess what, Ethan? Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, don't blame you if they get lost in the post. Got it, got it. Yeah, yeah, that's it. It'll be a bit... I mean, Craig, there's a, there's a, there's a little chance. It's quite a high chance, actually, that, that your presence might get lost in the post. But uh, it's the thought that counts, isn't it? It's the thought that counts. Oh, Ethan, congrats, man. That is sick. My voice is genuinely going. Um, was it everything you thought of, or was it was it tricky, or what kind of questions were you asked? Um, that's awesome, though. Hey, Akos as well. Good evening. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Um, GSX isn't working, but it's not the end of the world. Um, the Avro RJ is now out for Microsoft Flights from 2024. Uh, much to my surprise, I had an email, uh, a few days ago. I don't know when it was. Um, and they were basically saying, uh that it's been updated and it's compatible with 2024. I was like, blimey, that was quick. Um, I wasn't originally planning... I'm going to get rid of the Christmas songs already. Um, I wasn't originally planning to stream the Afro RJ today. I was sort of torn between flying the 747 um, or...
my flying down to the southernmost airport in the world, uh, which I haven't got Volanta open. I was going to show you, but I haven't got it open. Ah, I've got Navigraph charts open, though. Uh, this is where we currently are, chat. Very, very rare you see me all the way down here. Um, I appreciate there's there is an airport of Rafira or something down here, um, but this is still known as the southernmost airport in the world. Uh, Sierra Charlie Gulf Zulu. Um, I've also got Ushia scenery installed. Um, this that's in Argentina. We're flying to Chile. Um, I think there's lots of like government situations with which country's in what country and whatever. I don't think these two airports fly between the two because of the situation, but I don't really know. All I know is it's near the Falklands and Top Gear had some sort of drama here um, with, like, number plates or something. So, yeah, I'm, I can't really remember. Um, Blakey, thank you very much for your resub. Happy Monday. Uh, no message, but you're coming with two months of Twitch Prime Happy Monday. Thank you very much for tuning in. You're a legend, Blakey. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, very bad pronunciation, Sim Race, yes. Ushia. Ush Ushia. Aiden, hello. Blakey, thank you again, mate. I appreciate the reason. Thank you so much. Um, Neves as well. Great to see you. Good evening. Hello. Why not fly the way to Antarctica? It's two and a half hours, Revy. Uh, if I wanted to fly to Antarctica today, it's two and a half hours. And uh, I don't have two and a half hours this evening, so... Sorry. Um... A day stream, absolutely. Um, uh, but I again I had to catch up with loads of stuff during the day today. So yeah. No uh no day stream today, just evening and yeah. If, if we were if we were departing two and a half hours from now, we'll be landing at ten PM, but it meant the stream would have to go live earlier and it wouldn't have worked with everything. So there you go. Um Kevin, hi or oh, hello. Hi. Uh this flight is forty minutes. Not that long, um, but I'm planning if you guys want to return a career mode after, we can either fly back or we can do career mode. Ugly plan, waiting. Ug right, ugly livery or ugly plane, Kevin? Do you not like the BA-146 or do you not like the livery? Can't wait to fly something silly on this flyer. Blue wrap. Is this you? You're crazy. Uh, also, chat, one thing I've noticed, this is the first ever airport I've ever taken off on with yellow runway markings. I know the reason why they paint them yellow, but I have never seen a runway like this. It's not the first... Really? Somewhere in Norway, I bet. I bet it's somewhere in Norway. I've never seen a runway like this, though. Ever. Oslo had... You had. What in the American road is that? <laughs> Does Svalbard have it? I've been to Svalbard recently and I don't remember it being bright yellow like this. Livery is good. I do not like the Avro. Don't kill me, please. It's okay, Kevin. I won't. Just do, your time's counting down. Uh, no, it's fine. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Wait, why is it yellow? A uh, snow. I'm pretty sure it's because of snow. So, obviously, snow's white. Runway markings are white. Um, and it's a lot easier to see yellow through snow. You know, yellow snow, but slightly different situation. That is that not the right reason? I don't know. Callum's putting question marks as if I've got it wrong. Oh, snow, snow can be yellow, yeah, but I wouldn't touch yellow snow. Um, I, I wouldn't recommend it anyway. Uh, yeah, increases visibility. Exactly, exactly, exactly. Anyway, we're at uh, Arenas right now. Um, this is payware scenery. Rev's gonna hate me for saying that. I paid uh, a whole 10 euros for this. Uh, about 8 British pounds. Um, yeah, I don't go much on it, but, um, it's from a developer I've never heard of, but it's better than freeware, so... Uh, Yellow Snow's Frozen Beer. If that's what you want to think, Rev, then, uh, by all means, uh, continue to... I, I say, uh, yeah. I did need to think that. It's fine. Ian will never learn. Well, it's not a bad scenery. It's just, I've seen much, much better. <laughs> uh, it tastes like lemon. Oh, God. Yeah, don't, don't, no. I remember being a kid and, like, putting my mouth in the air with my tongue out, just, like, trying to catch the snow. Everyone's done that as a kid. Everyone's done that as a kid. Um, it's a good scenery as well, exactly, and it's eight quid, I mean, you, I, I know eight quid's eight quid, but, like, you can't really go wrong, to be fair, you can't really go wrong, um, right, I'm gonna turn the sim, whoa, that 747 is loud, 
Oof, my left ear is loving that right now. You still do that, Ethan. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter what age you are, you know. We haven't had snow where I live for ages, though, so I haven't been able to do that, but uh, never mind. Um, another thing as well, uh, GSX isn't on at the moment. It doesn't work for me on this aircraft. I don't know why. I've tried everything, but GSX just crashes every time I load into the RJ. Updated GSX, planes updated, removed like aircraft profiles, can't get it working. So uh, I don't think it matters because I think this stand, looking at the tire marks, we can just kind of pull right and then just taxi. So it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. Oh, is it the air? Oh, it's the airport rev. It's not the plane. It's the airport. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Of course, any builds could do better, but I don't think any builds are going to focus on Sierra, Charlie, Charlie, India, because they don't probably will, won't get many sales uh, <laughs> uh, marketing. Um, but yeah, any builds would obviously cook a lot more than uh, they have. But uh, yeah, there's also a... Uh, we're in... Basically, the call sign's DAP. The airline we're flying is DAP. Um, and it looks like we've got the exact same reg plane over here. I know the plane doesn't have a reg. No idea. Um, also, don't hate me for realism. In real life, they fly this plane in the 146, like 300. We're obviously in the Avro RJ. Please don't, like, you know, just, just don't mention it. Um, oh, really? Right. Whoever this is, do you mind? Little bit personal space, thank you. I now cannot see or control or turn on my aircraft. Hello? Thank you. Every time. Dwarfy, good evening. Hello. Uh, who's Voof? Or Juice TV. Both. Oh, calm. Jacob with the. UK, yeah. Because sometimes J is pronounced Y. Um, Jacob's lot. Hello. Welcome in. Good evening, everybody. Wrap up warm. Get your coats on. Um, we are down in the middle of... Well, in the very, very south of the world at the moment. Um, in a place uh, in Argentina. We're flying to a place in Chile. Um, and believe it or not, it's actually Chile in Chile. Um, so, yeah. That's where we are. That's what we're doing. And uh, basically, we're copying Noel Phillips' flight that he did a few months ago on YouTube. Uh, but welcome in, Jacob. Hello, hello. It wasn't even close, no. <sighs> Four months switch prime, I'll do my homework. I'll get better, I'll get better. What a beauty of a plane. Yeah, Shot Kiev doesn't think so. <laughs> Kevin's like, I like I, I like the livery, but I, I just don't like the 146. Uh, it's not that. Right, Kevin, the Avro RJ is much better than the 146, all right? It's got modern avionics, and it's just... It is an ugly plane, and the engines are hairdressers. Uh, no, not hairdressers. No, that's... No, let me rephrase it. The engines are... Uh, hoovers? No. What's the saying? Hair dryers! That's the one! <laughs> oh, that's the quote of the day. Okay, yeah, the engines are hair dryers. <laughs> I, was like, I said hair dryers. I was like, that doesn't sound right. <laughs> oh, it's never a dull moment, is it? No, yeah, well, <laughs> whatever. I, I'm not even gonna no right batteries. Uh, we'll go and uh, we'll go and get plugged in. That whoever this is, have you got your engines running already? Because bloody hell, I can't even hear the plane. It's very loud. I can't even turn up my sim because I've got that in my left ear. Can I mute like V pilot other fucking planes? Oh, it's Rev's Apu. Rev's got his Apu on already. Rev, it's very loud. Who's the Pan Am anyway? Who is the Pan Am? Uh, it's the new, exactly. We've got a Ford Dyson vacuum cleaners. Um, you've been cancelled by hair... Yeah, I hope none of you are hairdressers. Um, I just told you it was me. Oh, I thought it was Blue Rat. PAA 54. And then we've got FAC 09. I don't know who's who. I've got no idea. Um, Ollie, oh no. Trouble...
Good evening. Favourite little meme. Aww. Thank you for a quarter of century of years. Mumps. You're a bit beyond a quarter of a century of years, Ollie. Um, I'm joking. I, I might, I don't know. Ollie, thank you for tier one for 25 months. Good evening. Hello. Uh, Revs and A310, your model matching is whack. What's your model matching showing then? Oh. Right, D is this like a bring your biggest plane to work day? Chat, we're flying into a very small airport. You're brave soldiers. We now have a beluga. See, that's good model matching. I swear that ain't me. Dwarfy, that, that, that's coming from someone who sounds very guilty right now. Nav data out of date. <sighs> I forgot to update the airplane. Jamie did this as well. Jamie forgot to update his air rack. It must be a streamer curse. Moving on swiftly. No one say wallop, please. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, I completely forgot you had to, uh do that on this aircraft uh never mind it's okay uh rev also there you go revs also did it as well dwarfy's busy in ets2 fair play i need to turn the sim down my left ear is hating that sound right now um yeah i want to do an ets2 convoy chat i might need your help with that um so uh how many of you would join a euro truck convoy over christmas i'll try and plan it between like either christmas and new year or just before christmas because we are due one, and the amount it's requested is insane. Um, okay, we, we, I'll try and figure something out because I obviously need to start emailing people, talking to talking about it, trying to get it under. You know, it's not something that I can just be like, oh, here's the route and we just drive it. I mean, it might be, um, but obviously, if it's Trucker's MP or something, that's a lot better. Oh my god, my ears. Thank you for turning it off. Um, you'll be working. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Me, yes. Me, yes. How many of you have enough mods for pro mods? Oh, you're back. Um, or do we do it not on pro mods? No, 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 no mods. I mean, DLC rev, like, because I think pro mods is just so much better for, like, choosing a route in, like, Norway or Iceland or something. Uh, well, Igar is technically Antarctica. It's below the South Pole. So this is like the southernmost airport to the South Pole, if that makes sense. Igar does exist in Antarctica, um, but it's not a passenger route, if that makes sense. Uh, so yeah, you can fly into Igar and stuff, but it's not for passengers. Um, but yeah. All the e all the ETS2 DLCs are on sale. Thanks, Jacob. There you go. If anyone wants it, yeah. You don't need Grease yet, though. If, if, you, for pro mods, you can have Grease. You don't have to have Grease, though. Um, so it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. Um, is there IRSs on this plane? Or were they... Ah, yes. They were over here from memory. There we go. Uh, are you live on Christmas Eve? I should be, yeah. The only days I will not be live is Christmas Day and Boxing Day. Um, because I'll be with family and stuff like that. But yeah, I should be on Christmas Eve. I mean, who? what do, you, what do people do on Christmas Eve? I mean, I, genuinely, I, I don't know. Some pe I suppose some people have start Christmas, like, a day early or whatever. But, um, yeah, we, we don't really do anything Christmas Eve. It's more Christmas Day and then Boxing Day and then sort of onwards from there. But, uh, S-C-G-Z. There we go. If you're a normal country, you celebrate Christmas on Christmas Eve. Fly to Lap Lapland. Yeah, Jamie. So this Saturday we're doing Flying Sea Santa. This Saturday we're doing Flying Sea Santa. Evening, Danny. Hi. Um, 24th is the way to go. Okay, well, if 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 uh, the, the convoy will not be on the 24th. Absolutely not. Way too close to Christmas. I'll have to... I'll, I'll try and pick a day where everyone's sort of free as much as they can. Obviously, I can't please everybody, but yeah. Uh, what runway for departure? Uh, let me turn music down a little bit. Uh, we have a resub. Uh, so that's the flight plan. Uh, 39 minute flight. We're departing runway 30, I think. Uh, Skyperion, hello, hello, hello. Well, oh yeah, Rev, yeah. I, I hope that I get my letter, though, well. from Royal Mail. Um, I mean, at the moment, I haven't had anything. Uh, the post is, for some reason, like, super delayed at the minute. Um, Skyperion, 10 months, double digits, tier 1. Thank you very much for your resub. A very good evening. Happy Monday as well. Welcome. Uh, I'm in a sim during flight. That's still, Jacob, that's a flex, mate. I would much rather be in a sim 
uh, over Flying Sea Santa. Do you did you did you have a slot then? It's just it was last minute planned, or did you not have a slot anyway? Happy Monday, hi. Good evening, Aaron. How are you? Good evening, FG Swift as well. Yes, we have taken inspiration from Noel Phillips today. Um, a little bit concerned why these aren't turning on as well. I think we've. Uh, I might have just forgot to do something, or I can't. I don't really know. We've got all of the avionics switched on. We've got this on. We've got all of that on. I just don't quite understand why none of these screens are turning on. Is it a skill issue, or have I genuinely forgot something? Andy, good evening. Hello, Medes as well. Great to see you. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Hi, hi, hi. If you're just tuning in, chat, we are officially chasing the sun down to the southernmost point in, well, the normal world that's not in Antarctica. Um, and we're flying. This is the first time I've ever flown this plane, actually. It's pretty cool. It's really, really cool. Uh, your engine instruments are cooked. You have the same bug I have, Ian. Is there anything I can do other than just press escape and then restart? Howling Crazy, good evening. Hi. Hello. There's a switch below nav display. Uh, switch below nav. Where's nav display, Jacob? Do, 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 do. I think you got to restart. Oh, my God. Wait, what? What have I done? No, no. Stop laughing at me. Oh, because I said about nav display. Oh! You just need to turn on EFIS1 master. Nav display. Primary flight display. How long have I been flight simming for? Um, what's the long wire from the tail to the middle of the aircraft? Uh, that. Oh, lag. Lag. Lots of lag. Lots of lag. Lots of lag. Oh, no. What's happening? You need to restart, Ian. It's the bug. Okay. I'll restart the session. We didn't really do too much anyway. It's fine. Hardware limitation. Yay. Anyway, it's okay, chat. Last night, Ian asked me how to turn on HDR. I did, but then I Googled it and found out that you just type in HDR in your Windows search bar and it's perfectly fine. We're back! Alright. Let's try that again, shall we? We're not on live weather. Sim's frozen. Oh. <sighs> I think we just give up now and load back in the sim. Yep, we give up now. <sighs> ETS2. <laughs> I would love to, Calamron. I can't lie. No, I, I'm determined. We don't give up on flight sim. We load back in and go again. Uh, it will wait for you unless I get bored. Mate, I, I, oh wait, no, 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 it's fine, we'll load back in. It won't take long to load back in. It's fine. Maybe stick to the built-in aircraft and not add-on aircraft. Yeah, but it said it was compatible, though. Just Flight said it's compatible for 2024, so... You know, you have to just assume that it's perfectly fine. The Phoenix is perfect. But... I, I'm fed up of flying Airbus, chat. I want to fly Boeing. And I'm not flying 2020, so I'll stop complaining. Uh, oh, 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 way, oh, way, oh. Oh, yeah, chat, I was, uh, oh, what's this? I, um, I would, do you know Francis? Do you know the, um, do you know the guy who flew in, the Bravo Airspace guy, Airspace guy yesterday at TNCM, um, where he landed his, his Bravo Airspace? I had a good little email chain with him earlier on today. Um, and he was basically, well, let me get the email up, actually. He was saying what an awesome, pe what awesome people we are, basically. Uh, Hi, Kenko. Uh, I had fun approaching and landing into TNCM today. Uh, blah, 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 blah. And then he told me something that I can't tell you. Um, and then he said... Oh, no, I can't say that bit. And then he just said, Thanks a lot, Kenko, for being so cool and expressing your love for Flight Sim. It actually helps uh, someone like me re-energize my batteries. So I love that. So, uh, yeah. Big up, Francis. Big up, Francis. He also attached a little cheeky screenshot, but I don't know if I can share that screenshot with you. <laughs> I might anyway. I don't know. I can't. I can't. He might have sent a certain screenshot of a certain 789. 
but um, I don't think it's best. I don't think it's best. Um, he basically offered me potentially the beta of it, but obviously I don't. I don't stream twenty twenty, so uh, the answer was no. Never mind. It's okay. Right. Anyway, we're loading back in. I mean, the spacing was nothing to do with me, Particle, mate. I was first in. I had nothing to do with the ATC spacing. I wanna know. Oh, oh, what? Bluebird, no, Bravo Airspace. He makes the Dreamliners. He makes the Dreamliners. Where do you go? Oh, sorry about ch this chat. I do apologize, but I'm hoping that when we load back in, we'll just sort of quickly set up and just get going. I don't stream 2020. Not anymore, no. Do, do, do. <laughs> Don't mention spacing. I'll get angry. Sorry, Ollie. You're probably having a good day driving your... Well, sorry, your Tesla driving you into a parking spot. So lazy, honestly. So lazy. Come on, Sim. I know you can do it. Good evening, Septi. It's almost D-Day. It's almost D-Day. What, 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 what time tomorrow, Septi? Excuse me, what time tomorrow? Do, 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 do. you probably not be in the loading screen if you stream 2020, though, Michael. I know, but, you know, I'm not complaining too much, so it's fine. I just, I don't know. I just don't have any energy for 2020. I Personally, I genuinely don't. But there we go. 8.30, no idea when it ends. It'll be a long day. Get some rest early, Septi. I know it's only 8 p.m., but go to bed like an hour earlier than you normally do. 2020 is better. Yeah, 2020 is more stable. Visually, 2024. Any day of the week. Visually, 2024. I'm not saying 2020 looks crap. It doesn't. It looks good. But I think the enhancements and whatever on 2024 is better than 2020. It's just this sim is in alpha state still. But yeah. Right. Start. Free flight. All the way down here in the middle of nowhere. We've already got the plane going, which is good. We were at ramp five and start flight. I know energy for 2020. That statement makes no sense. Why? That's normal. That's Coatl just crashing. I I no energy for 2020. I don't know how does how does that not make sense? Um, how is the weather turbulence and just general physics feel? Uh, with FS realistic, Mick, but good. Um. I'm, I think it look. I think, I don't know, I, I can't comment. I've got no idea how it feels in real life, so... Don't mention physics to me. I, I just fly a plane, and if it flies, then I'm happy. Um, no, no, it's the airport, Andy. It's, this is this is the airport that does this. It'll probably keep shouting at me. It eventually, it eventually does stop beeping. Uh, I wonder if I've got to... Oh, yeah, I'll have to restart V-Pilot as well. Right, before we connect to VATSIM, can I just check that the plane actually turns on now? I wonder if just I wonder if that's just flights for 2020, probably 2024s. Uh, I don't really need those on yet, but we'll get them on anyway. Uh, battery, battery, and we'll get GPU connected. Forward passenger. Give it a second. Hmm... Right, don't lag. Please don't lag. Please don't lag. Please don't lag. Please don't lag. I think we nailed it. I hope we nailed it. V pilot. Boom. This sim requires more energy to deal with all the current nuisances. Yeah, but I'm... I don't give up. I never give up. Connect. Um... It's an issue with the plane. Oh, okay. It's an issue with the plane. So now, now, Rev, you're pretty confident it'll be fine for the rest of the stream now. Good. I'm just going to turn the sim down because I can't be, I can't be hearing that engine. Uh, okay, clear. I presume the plane will get updated soon enough. It will get updated soon enough. It'll work now. Your engine, your engine screens are normal. Oh, could you tell that they were different then? I mean, the sim's not lagging, so we're chilling. We're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. We pray, Dommy. We pray. Um, right, nav, nav. Uh, we'll go and put in all of this again. It won't take us too long. Obviously, we want to get out of here as soon as we can now. So, Sierra Charlie Charlie India. Uh, that's direct to Sierra Charlie Golf Zulu. Sierra... Oh, no. Not... not. Eh. Where's the delete key? I have not flown this plane in ages as well. Clear. S C G Z next song 
Flight number DAP 20. 20. And then runway 30 for departure. And then we've got a few waypoints to put in. Director Almir. I think this plane's got some brief integration, but... Wrong one. There we go. And then Victor of 115. Mm, 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 mm. Sunley. And then that puts us in for the arrival. Easy as that. Um, uh, oh, is it Simbrief download? Okay, well, I don't have that, so I do have it, but I haven't set it up, so that's fine. Uh, oh, no, exe no, the execute activate button was a 787, wasn't it? Yeah, that's fine. Whoa, oh, what's love got to do, got to do with... How do I do the, um... Ah, that's how I do it. Departure runway 30. We don't have a SID, because all the SIDs go northbound. Three zero execute and then the arrival runway two six VOR alpha calm easy. Uh, why is the camera walking around? That's a very good question because I don't have a profile. Hang on, profile cloud import. It will stop rocking now. Much better. It was FS realistic. Um, restarted sim but did not. Nick, you knew about that. You knew about that. To be fair, someone probably mentioned it. I just didn't see their message. Rep. Oh, well. Uh, 230. It's fine. There's going to be no ATC where we are anyway, so no one will know. Uh, right. We'll start boarding. We've got stairs. It's not GSX integrated, so I might be able to just literally click. How much fuel do we need? 4861. 4861. Enter. Zero fuel weight three six nine oh seven. Three six nine oh seven. Enter and then start boarding. We're gonna be heavy, but that's fine. Evening Toby, hi! George as well, great to see you. Hello, welcome. Hi, hi, hi. You darts at school, no way. Mate, it looks like you're literally in primary school though. GCSE revision, but then underneath you've got thousandth, hundredths, tenths, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, hundred thousands. This is a right angled triangle. This is a rhombus. How old are you, George? I'm joking. Um, <laughs> right, execute. Transition altitude 18,000 feet. Zero fuel weight, uh, 36.9. Hopefully you uh you beat all your mates at darts though. I'm sure you absolutely smashed them. Uh reserve fuel 2.4 or 2.3. We'll go 2.3. You smoked the teacher. Good. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. Uh, I know it's fine. You're, oh, so you are literally on GCSE year then. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Uh fuel's in a separate tab on the EFB. Uh oh yeah, fuel's disappeared now. Why is fuel disappeared? Four eight six one. Oh. Maybe ah, oh, hang on. Let us just do that. There you go. I didn't realise yet to press it again. Right, I'm gonna stop the music and we'll just hear the sim. Uh, what approach are you doing? The VOR runway two six is what I've got. Um, there actually, believe it or not, is a chart for this airport, which is crazy. Um, I don't know what if there is a chart for the RMP runway. Yeah, so I can imagine we. I don't. I mean, this is literally we're flying over a river, right? Where, we'll, we'll if there's enough time, we'll try and watch Noel Phillips video in cruise. But to the north of this is uh, this is Argentina, this is Chile, um, and we're literally flying on the border of it, um, and then we're landing in runway two six. So there you go. Uh, b -b -b below ground air, James. Below ground air. Huh? I think I've done it now, though. I think I've done it. Uh, is this... No, 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 no. It's very close, though, Alfie. So, we crashed here. Uh, and we're landing Port Will it put Puerto Williams. So, this is the southernmost airport in the entire world. Obviously, if you ignore uh, the one down here. Uh, a not so... There's, there's another one. It's the southernmost passenger airport in the world. Uh, Porto Williams. Uh, the, I crashed in Argentina. This this one's in Chile. Uh, just literally south of it. So it's even further south and we're up here. At the moment, anyway. 
Um, let's go, James. Welcome in. Hello, Chile. Yes, Chile, Chile, uh, Chile, Chile, like the, the the country. Chill, like like smell like that. Chile, Chile, chill. Um, well, it's the it, okay. The most southern. I mean, the the southernmost passenger airport in the world. Then, if you want to be uh, if you want to be techy with it, it's about Chile. Yeah, that's the food you eat though. Um, this doesn't look like Antarctica. Hashtag clickbait stuff. Nice one. I mean, it's a penguin. It says Antarctic on it. It's a real flight they did, so it might be good enough. We could have flown to Antarctica today, but uh, I didn't want to because it was two and a half hours, and that's a lot of time. Uh, these IRS is going to take ages to align. I've just realized. Why are they going to take ages to align? What have we not done? What's love got to do, got to do with, hmm. Maybe it's just time. I, I'd assume it's just time. Um, how do you go about doing these speeds in this plane? No idea. Uh, we'll put 230 in here, though. Do, 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 do. Uh, loads of messages. Flight plan one grubby aircraft. You click the chart. Yeah. Oh, yes, that's it. Thank you. Cheers. I have short-term memory loss. If I click that, it's automatically put in 140 for me. Legend. Thank you. Also, throttle can't be turned on, though, for some reason, but that's fine. Oh, God. I wouldn't say dirty. I mean, I, I'd say icy. That does not look very good, mate. Is this in, this is in your career mode as well? If, the, if you own this Cessna... Good luck paying uh, the damage. Although it's ice, though, but it doesn't look great. Um, we don't even have engines on, and you want to do auto on auto and auto thrust. Well, it's obviously something I need to do before we take off, Rev, but maybe I'm a bit premature with that one. Uh, I don't know. Uh, runway 25 for departure. No, runway 30 for departure, actually. Uh, 306. We could just do 25 for departure. 25 or 30. Hang on. Uh... Out of the two, ideally I want to depart this one. Well, I want to depart 2-5. We'll depart 2-5 instead, because it just makes more sense. 2-5 uh, for departure, and then that is heading 2-5-6. 2-5-6. And you need to start the engines to take off anyway. Yeah, that's true. Okay, I'll, I'll turn the auto throttle on after the engine start. Uh, our nav, VNAV, uh, VNAV won't turn on just yet for some reason, because that's because the IRSs haven't aligned. 1005 will pull this out as well. Uh, I'm just trying to re-familiarize myself with this plane. Uh, we'll get the APU started. Engine air, no. Packs, no. Cabin air, we don't need to touch just yet. Fuel pumps we can turn on. That's fine. I think we're okay. Beacon light, nav light, logo wings, entry. Nice. There we go. Uh, hi, Lucas. You weren't ignored, mate. I just barely seen any chat messages. Hi. Always ignored. Always. Sorry. Um, hello, Andrew. Hello. Uh, Nutrient as well. Great to see you. Welcome in. Hi. Um, yeah, we temporarily paused the AMD thing. I will resume it. It's just there's a lot going on at the moment. Um, and I just need to f figure out how. Uh, beacon lights ready for push. Yeah, we're ready for push as soon as the IRSs have aligned. Um, I don't know what else we've got to really do. We've got our V-speeds in. We've got our altitude. Uh... APU's just on now, so we can connect to the APU gen. Uh, we can turn off the external power. And we'll remove the chocks, make sure parking brake is set as well. Oh, and we can't remove the chocks. Why can't the chocks be removed? I'm not sure. Uh, hello, uh, Electric as well. How are you? Hello. Good evening, Marcus. Hi. Do we install... Oh, the chocks are still there. Hmm. There should be a way to remove them in a minute. That plane is so loud. It's it's genuinely hurting my brain. Um, yeah, Toby, they did. There's still a few little bugs with it, though. Oh, there you go. Chocks removed now. We just have to, have to wait a few seconds. IRS is still haven't aligned, though, which is a bit worrying, no? I feel like they should have aligned by now. We've been sat here for, like, seven minutes. Hmm. Maybe it's just on real-time alignment, unless I can fast-forward them. There's nothing there about IRS alignment. So. It just it takes longer than seven minutes. Okay, we'll just be patient then. 
we'll uh, we'll await further instructions. But yeah, we're not. Uh, we can get the engine. To be fair, we could probably get the engine started. Actually, we'll get the hairdressers started. Uh, I can't believe I said that earlier. Skill issue. Right, we'll start engine number four. Yeah, I know you use Aerosol Frankfurt, but when you use Virtual FRA, what GSX-4 do you use, or do you not use one at all? Uh, I never used a Virtual FRA. I use, uh, last time I was at Frankfurt, I used the freeware that came with the sim, the Asobo one, because Frankfurt causes me so many lag issues. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I, I just, just type, I literally type in Virtual FRA GSX profile, and the chances are there'll be one that pops up. Um, I'm not too sure. Uh, you're very far- Oh, is that how it works, Shamrock? The further away from the equator you are, the, uh, the longer it takes to align. I mean, that would make logical sense, but that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Um, going back home from uni on Saturday. Oh, what for Christmas? Oh, Toby, you're gonna love that, man. You're gonna love that. To get in 2024 and the Phoenix. Nice. Did you not bring your PC to uni then? Or is there not, like, enough room in, in your room and stuff like that? Uh, how did you think it worked? I don't know. I, n I didn't have any idea how IRS aligned, but I guess we are very, very, very south. Um, there is an airport in Antarctica, correct, but it's not a passenger airport. The A310 sounds are hot. I, Rev, I said, oh my god, chat, we still need to do our Pan Am A310 flight into Kaitak. I had it planned like a week ago and we've never done it. I need to, someone remind me, Sam seen Kaitak, Kaitak, fly a Pan Am A310 into Kaitak. I don't know where from, but we need to make it happen soon. Is the IRS and NAV uh, over here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're both on NAV. It says NAV off though, weirdly. But I don't really want to touch them. I don't. I don't know why it's saying NAV off. That doesn't seem right. That really doesn't seem right. Uh, yeah, southernmost passenger airport. Exactly, exactly. The Avro is updated for yes, Joel. Hello, good to see you, Joel. You need to put it in ALN. Do you? I can't though. I can't even switch it back now. <laughs> coming, coming out from under the rock. Um, it's just broken. I I don't know what to do. And we need that to align before we can push back. We'll go and start another engine. Um, I'm just hoping and praying it just sort of turns online. There's no way. It's not like a Concorde. You can't tell how many, like, numbers it is away. Um, I caught four guys on camera trying to get into my... You're joking, Cameron. What? I, I, I bloody hope they failed. That's mad. There was four people in, like, probably, like, balaclavas trying to get into Cameron's car this morning. What? That's mad. I mean, I hope you reported it, but the problem is they probably can't do too much with the footage. Uh, guys, why is there 2024 loading slash launching music? Uh, Joel! Uh, just turn it down in the volume mixer. That's what I do. That's what I do. I hope you had your baseball bat with you. Yeah, they deserve they deserve to have a baseball bat to them. They genuinely do. Uh, thank Hello, you, darling. Joel. Hi. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Here's thank you. Oh, it's aligned! Much love, yes. less than three. Much love back to you, mate. Thank you very much, Joel. Al Plagiato is not going to be at all pleased with you, um, but I really do appreciate the five pound donation. Um, again, Joel, I feel like we need a big catch up sort of between Christmas, New Year, or into January. Um, but need to say uh, thank you for your donation. It's great to see you as always. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. You didn't have to do that, but thank you. Uh, they went up and down my road. No masks. All grey tracksuit. Right under street lights. Idiots. They. I, I mean, I know there's value to your car, and your car kind of stands out among others, Cameron, but, like, do they not have better things to do with their life than steal cars? Like, what a low life they must live. <laughs> Genuinely, like, I don't understand people like that. They wake up at 2 a.m. in the morning with their mates. They're trying to be all cool. Oh, my God, we're going we're gonna to go steal some cars tonight, lads. And then they're, they're just going to end up in prison in a few years' time. Yeah, <laughs> that, that was fun, wasn't it? Um, it's crazy. Uh, Japan and Crashing Mango, not today, mate. No, it wasn't on my agenda, but you never know. Might happen, maybe. Sadly, that's the state of the UK these days, yeah. I mean, I purposely keep my car very much on our drive that's gated, so... You know, and it's also behind my parents' car, so if they wanted to get my car, they had to get my parents' car out the way before they can get my car, so... It's impossible for them to get my car, basically. Um, but yeah. 
Sorry if I missed any messages. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. This is why I now buy boring cars. Now, Captain Chaos, you've, you have you had a history of this? Uh, <laughs> uh, sorry for saying, saying Max flights where never. No. Oh, God, no, don't go forwards. Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. What am I witnessing? Oh, God. Right, you better be careful. This is a very, very precious penguin here. Yeah. There's a beluga here as well. We've almost got all the engines started. Oh, I have no words. Right, we'll get engine one started. Rev says, I have problems. What's your problems? Quas! Lewis Hamilton number of resubs. Let's go. Rev, is all your engines started, mate? Engine number one. Flaps 18. Baba ding, baba boom. Bada bing, bada boom. Um, Josh, I need to, uh, I need to sort, I need to sort out some more flights where you can control because I feel like I, I need, I, I, it's about time that I need my Joshua Seagrave controlling. Um, but I haven't really flown in the UK very much lately, so I guess that's a down of the fault of my own. Um, and I can imagine you being a very busy person as well. Um, thank you very much for 44 months of tier one. Hopefully well. I guess you're working all throughout, like, the Christmas period and stuff like that as well. Um, but thank you for your research. I appreciate that. Uh, Hamilton washed. Washed? He went from P16 to P4, Michael. Just because you're a little bit triggered that he's moving to Ferrari next year. Deal with it. Um, <laughs> thanks, Quas. Uh, you don't know. You don't. You don't. You didn't know I visit Van Chile. <laughs> I'll see you in a minute, then, Josh. Uh, yeah, that's not happening, is it? No, no. Leah, uh, we don't talk about Leclerc. The Leclerc's not the point. We're focusing on Hamilton here, Michael. We're not focusing on Leclerc, just Hamilton's progress as an individual. P16 to P4. Leclerc done very well as well, but you know, ignore Hamilton. He's not in part of the question. Uh, you definitely was. I, I know, I know. Like, I, I, there's not really many places in uh, in Chile to control, is there? Um, right, both gens on. We'll get the start master off as well. Um, we'll use APU air uh, for the time being. We'll use engine air after departure. We'll keep the APU turned on, though. Um, Fast and Zebra signs on, and we're going to taxi out of here, uh, providing we are on somewhat of a unicom, uh, which we're not on unicom. We were on unicom, but our sim decided to die. On my back. There we go. Boom. Uh, progress as an individual. Bro is still crying about 2021. Hamilton even admitted that it was Max season. It was Max's world championship. He even admitted that. Um, so he's got seven world championships. Max is on. Uh, I want to get this right. Four? Or three? I don't know. Uh, Alex, good evening. How are you? Hello. Uh, I was trolling. I know it's four. I just, you know, it might be three one day. Um, thank you for tuning in. Alex, you sent me a message like a minute after I went live. I will reply to it after if that's okay. If that's okay. Um... Right, I want to get out of here because we've been on, we've been here for way too long. It's ten past eight. Chat will be live. At Rev. Uh, it's never a dull day in a Kenko stream. Marcel, good evening. How are you? Hello. I'll be in bed, but no worries. That's okay, Alice. You can reply to me when you wake up really early, and I have my nice lie in tomorrow. That's fine. Rev, um, it's fun. I appreciate Rev joining. He's just a bit big. <laughs> He's just a bit big. Um, holy zoinks with the resub as well. Rev says I'm not even touching you. Ao? Are you? Are you an A310? I know. I know he's an A310. I know he's an A310. It's bad model matching. Um, Zoinks, thank you for 11 months tier 1. Obviously, Cross with the 44. Skyperian with the 10. There's, there's so many resubs today. Thank you so much. I appreciate that, Zoinks. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hi, Bella. Hi, Lisa. Hello. Oh, my God, chat. Uh, Bruce was the most naughty dog in the world today. I'm not even joking. Um, he was very naughty. Alice, has mum told you about this yet? Um, so, my parents went out into Canterbury during today for, like, food shopping and Christmas shopping and whatever, whatever they were doing. Um, is my throttle calibration... Ah, my throttle's not calibrated. Uh, that's fine. We'll just leave it like this for now. Um, yeah, I went downstairs early when my parents were out. Bruce tore about two ball balls 
and something else off the Christmas tree. He was covered in glitter. The ball ball was shredded into like a million pieces on the floor. And Bruce just kind of had his tail between his legs when I came downstairs and stared at me. And I was like, Bruce, what have you done? He knew he did wrong straight away, but... But what, what was he thinking? Why did he tear off a ball ball off the, or two of them? Covered himself in glitter. Luckily, I don't think he consumed any of the ball balls. But, like, he's not normally like this. He was a very naughty boy. It, they, they were plastic, luckily. We purposely don't put glass ball balls on the lower half of the Christmas tree. Because of situations like that. That's what you get for taking his balls. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. It's revenge, isn't it? Yeah, but Bruce is probably like, well, you took my balls. I'm taking your ball balls. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Uh, right, yeah, nice one, Rev. Well done. Emergency light is not armed. I'll get those arms now. There we go. Ah! Um, Nutri 100 bits. Thank you. Oh, of brilliant. Of course you blame Bruce when it was you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it, Nutri, mate. Yeah, yeah. It was all me. I just decided to cause it. I just had a, I had a, I had a paddy downstairs. No, Bruce knows he's done very wrong. A chat, I've just realised that we're going to be departing with a uh, tailwind. This moment with life, weather's not working. I don't know. Ah. You literally have no balls left on the tree by Christmas. No, we won't. We won't have any ball balls left, Alice. She even destroyed one of, um, she, like, one of, uh, I don't know which one it was. It was like a soft one. It was like a stringed one. I don't know. Bruce is just being a little menace at the moment, and, uh... I mean, within, within reason, I suppose, but at the same time, uh, it's kind of annoying. But there you go. Ian, that's not a runway, mate. Oh, is it not? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, Chili Traffic, uh, DAP20, we are being a bit dippy with that one. We'll continue our taxi behind Rev uh, for holding point runway 25. I thought I was holding the runway. I'm tired. It's been a long day of wrapping Christmas presents. It looked like a holding point. Come on. Chilly traffic. I don't know where we are in the world. We're somewhere. Maybe we're in Argentina. Who knows? Um, hello, F1 racer. Hi. He didn't touch ours when he was here, Alice. We'll find out on Wednesday. But the problem is he's being he's being watched by mum and dad on Wednesday. Whereas he was obviously on his own earlier today. So he's been a, he's, he was a bit more mischievous. Um, we'll do a quick flight control check as well. Uh, Milo! Hello. Good morning. It's a pleasure to see you, as always. Um, thank you, Alik, as well, with the follow. Hello. Uh, Dwarfy, just fly and fly some Where is my present? You missed the post to Australia. I, I, have I actually... Wait, is the, is the postal date already ended? Oh, it's fine. Milo, I shipped it out last week. I was wrapping up everyone else's Christmas presents. <laughs> yeah, yours... What? Your one was special priority. Your one was special priority. Left! Oh. Sorry, I didn't see Rev. We'll do a 180. We'll do a 180. Um, Milo, happy 21 months. Thank you very much. I hope you and the family are well, as always. And, um, yeah. Well, a chat basically bullied me to open a P.O. box. Um, so I've got a P.O. box. But the problem is that it's not even... I haven't got the details for it. So the, by the time that I get a P.O. box, Christmas would have been over and it would have been pointless. So I've, I'm starting to think it might have been a little bit of a waste of money. But uh, never mind. We'll see. We'll see. But yeah, just hit the reverses. Oh, no, I, I'm being difficult. Rev, are we going first? I don't know if we're going first. I mean, Rev's probably typing in chat, bless him. Oh, he's not. Rev's not even typing in on chat. Um, but yeah, thank you very much for seven resubs already today, guys. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, Cameron, I'll have a look at that as soon as I depart, if that's all right. Um, how do you know the details yet? They're sending them to me through Post Canada, but the Royal Mail, the UK postal system is crap. Um, you know, I, I, I bought something uh, at the start of... Oh, Rev says yes. I bought something at the start of, uh, like, basically the end of November, and it turned up today. And that was sent, like, second class, and that was, like, nearly two weeks for it to arrive. So, I'll be honest, I, I haven't got much hope for these getting these PO Box details, so, yeah. Uh, I know you did, Jersey, but uh, it took me some time. Also, yellow runway markings, chat. Because we're uh, very cold and it's meant to be snowing here. Yeah? Rev did type in chat. He told you to take off ahead of him. I missed and the message. And at least your postal service is not on strike for three weeks. On strike? That's not good. Hang on. Chat, I'm just going to do something. I'm going to go into like 
Mm, I'm going to go into like April. The reason I'm doing that is because all the trees are autumn and it really annoys me how Microsoft didn't think that there's a different season in the southern hemisphere. It's really annoying, although it doesn't seem they're updating. Um, we'll just get out of there. we got a flap set. Let's just go. It's just broken. Yeah. I don't understand how they can get southern and northern hemisphere seasons messed up, but there we go. At least your postal service isn't bankrupt. What? Right, Toga, Frosta, 80 knots. Royal Mail, uh, well, Royal Mail, not the Hello, best, Dan. but they're the, they're the only option we have. What, what just happened on frequency? I'm not sure. Uh, V1 and rotate. Don't sink. Oh, that, did, uh, that didn't sound good. Did we tail strike? I don't think we did. We might have tail strike. What's the rate of climb gear up? I don't think we pulled back that quickly, though, to tail strike. Never mind. We're in the air. After a whole hour. To be fair, we, we're in the air after the hour, because we had the sim crash and everything. That's not that bad at all. Don't sink. Flap zero. Do you guys like the livery? I think it's quite cool. We'll have to take a left-hand turn soon. Turn like a stick shaker. Probably stalled it. Uh, we shouldn't have gone flap zero that quickly. Right, left-hand turn and uh, airport traffic, DAP 2-0. Uh, we're airborne passing 1,700 feet. Got no idea where we just departed out of. Porto Williams? No, that's where we're going. Porto... I'm not, I'm not sure. Airport traffic. Uh, does career mode mean you're taking more helicopter exams? Uh, I'll probably leave those off today, to be fair. Maybe, I'm not sure. Maybe, but I'll probably leave those today. And yeah, the, the orange light probably did tell me what was wrong, but... Emergency lights not armed, I armed them. Emergency lights not armed. But they're armed. Bank angle, bank angle. Oh, sugar. Okay. Uh, right, if we go on the overhead, let me go and turn on engine air. Turn off APU air. Stop the APU gen. And we'll stop the APU. There we go. There's two switches for, what, the emergency lights? Where's the other one then, Rev? I'm not sure. Hey, light speed, mate. The 7TV thing's really, really cool. Good luck, Rev, and whoever else is on the ground for your departure. Good luck, good luck, good luck. In the top right, there's emergency lights. Oh, cabin emergency armed. Ah. Strobe would be beneficial as well. Bingo. Thank you. Although we've got some brake fan sell on. I'm not sure what that is. Right, we'll turn on autopilot. Turn on uh, autopilot one. VNAV doesn't work for some reason. And we want to be aiming for like speed 250. We'll go... What are we at? 6,500 feet. We'll go standard pressure speed 250. Uh, standard pressure. This flight's only half an hour, by the way. It won't be long. One zero one three. Perfect. There we go. Because they didn't bother putting it in in real life. Oh really? Is there no VNAV? Is there no VNAV in the Avro RJ? So I guess we're just kind of climbing how we feel like it. And at the moment we're losing a lot of speed. I'll go manual VS and we'll get that down. Save the years a little bit. Uh, did you turn on the brake fans? Probably. Uh, yeah, I did turn them on. Silly me. There we go. That's better. That's better. Perfect. Through 10,000 feet, we'll turn off the... Uh, oh, I never had them on. I was going to say we'll turn off the landing lights, but we never turned them on. Oh, well. And we'll zoom out on the range. Oh, it feels good to be in a 146, but not a 146. I've barely flown this in 2020, actually. I've probably done, like, two flights in it, maybe. All right, Sim's being turned down for a minute. Hi, Shane. Again, hi. Boogie Wonderland, Earth, Wind, and Fire. What a tune. Uh, ice detected. Uh, is there ice detected? Where do you know there's ice detected? Turn on ice detect. What, up here? Traffic Beluga five foot strop oh, for climbing two thousand two hundred from me. Oh, bless me. Um, yeah. 
Thank you. Oh. Cold. Right. We are very much on our way into a cold airport. This looks sick. There you go. Boom. We're climbing very steeply. Yeah. Something about that doesn't feel right. Uh, you turned on the free switches that you didn't need and not the single one you needed. <laughs> Does that surprise you, Rev? Oh, yeah. Turned it on. You're climbing with Toga. Cracked. Is that bad? We'll go back a little bit on the, uh... Oh, no, I can't. I can't move the throttles, chat. They're fixed in that position. For some reason. Press thrust. Press thrust. Next to level change. Rev, you must love me. Oh, thrust! Found it. Oh, sorry. Rev found it. So now I've pressed thrust. Oh, yeah, it's doing auto thrust now. Look at that. Um, oh, we've got bits. Press climb under the gear. Oh, it's a oh, Mac. Max climb or normal climb? Normal climb. Definitely normal climb. Oh, be alright. Norm. I'm not normal though, Rav. You know that. Boogie boogie yeah. dance. It doesn't matter if mm. you receive mm. presents mm. after Christmas if people have missed the postage cutoffs. It will be nice for you to receive things after the festive hype. Yeah, wait, Press I've got it for three months regardless, Jersey. So, any time from now until the 10th of March, I think I've got the P.O. box. Mm. So, even if um, we miss the Christmas lot, it's not the end of the world, is it? Hi, Planzo. Planzo, I need to... When you fly with me next, I need to focus that, make sure that I'm watching or landing. I think someone made a comment yesterday that uh, I don't... Well, I never watch your landings. Uh, oh, weather update. What the heck? Okay. I don't want cloud, though. I want to look at all the ground. Um... Oh, Rev, can you send me some Swedish Swedish fish? I've really wanted to try Swedish fish in my life. Like, even if it's just, like, a tiny little packet. I'll pay you. <laughs> it's, like, little red, like... It's, like, red... I think it's just red, like, chewy... Like, I don't know what Swedish, Swedish fish is. They're not Swedish, Ian. They're American. Oh... Right, no, hang on, no, Rev's gonna send me actual fish. No, 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 Rev, no, that's a terrible idea. Okay, don't worry, I'm on about these, Rev. Bad request, that link didn't work. Nah, this stuff, the, the, the sweets, Rev. But they're not Swedish, they're American. Well, why the heck are they called Swedish fish, then? I give up. Who knows? You can literally order them on Amazon, can you? Rev, that looks disgusting. Nah, I don't know what's in that tin. I don't want to know what's in that tin. Sturmovichin vidyavidyan. Sturmtromming, and he's trying to open it. What's inside it? Uh, nah, don't look at that YouTube short. That's grim, Rev. Rev, I'll ban you from my PO box if you want to send like, stuff like that. Thomas, good evening. How are you? Hello. It's literally like fish in a tin. Like, but Rev, you will not be able to donate any form of money to get me to eat that. You could donate 2,000 of your euros or Swedish Kronos, whatever you use, and I would still not eat it. It tastes a lot better than it looks. No, I, I honestly, I'd rather, I'd rather not. There's nothing, that is one of my worst fears. Like, I don't mind fish, but I'm not a seafood person at all, at all. Oh, Cameron, I won't show you the stream, but wait, hang on. I want to watch, Cameron sent the footage of the, the people trying to break into his car and steal it. 
Oh my god, it's literally like just four people in grey hoodies surrounding your car. Holy crap. What do they do? They just they just sort of had a look and almost attempt to break in and then realised that your car's fitted with something that they can't break it in with. And then carried on walking. Bruh. That's mad. Uh, I hear a challenge. No. There's no amount of money that can make me eat fish. Um, you wouldn't risk some maybe not so tasting food for that much. No. I uh, genuinely no. I'm scared of food like that. Top of descent in 80 miles. They, they they saw the steering lock. Oh, at least you've got a steering lock. I mean, I don't have one, but what is it? What what a steering lock? Is it something that goes across your wheel, or do you have something that's like plugged into your seatbelt? Because there's loads of different types of it, isn't it? I'm offering one million Zimbabwe dollars. Nice try. Um, baited white fish are good in the UK. I I don't like crab sticks. I don't like anything fish related. Although I, d I don't mind battered cod. Bit different though, isn't it? Um, Ian, check DMs. I sent you a video of me trying the delicious rev... Oh my god, you're joking, Michael. Just Can I show stream? Can I show stream? Can I please show stream? Oh my god, Michael, no. Let me download the video. Right, this is the fish we're talking about. This is Michael Wimmer right now. Well, not right now, but you know what I mean. He's just... He's eating that. <laughs> oh, oh, Michael. See, yeah. I told you. There's not any amount of food, that you, any amount of money that you can get me to eat that. They know the vid already. Most of them do. I, it was so effing disgusting. Yeah. And that's because he didn't prepare it properly. <laughs> Rev, when was the last time you ate stromba? Just stromba. When was the last time you ate that fish? This morning? Never. And you're trying to get me to eat it, but you've never had it yourself? What? Hypocrite. Honestly. Rev, I'm disappointed in you. Bullying. That's what it is. For breakfast. I don't know. 30 seconds in the microwave. <sighs> this will be fun, Blue Rat. I can't wait for you to land a beluga into this airport, mate. we got an A310 and a beluga flying into the southernmost part of the world. It's insane. Ian, you know you love me. Yes, yeah, Shane. Uh, me and my grandpa actually ate uh, this once and it wasn't bad. It's just the way I've been brought up, probably. Just, I'm not one to try out things. I've just disconnected my keyboard. There we go. Uh, it looked delicious, though. Delicious, Michael. That looks like something I'm like, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here, mate. Um, there's a video of a British woman opening the fish on a bus. You can hear everyone heaving. Yeah, I'm all right. <laughs> I'm all right. I'm good. I don't know what I've just been sent. What's this? A helicopter. This is a view outside my hotel room. Want to join? What heli helicopter is that? Is that like the police or something? Look, we now know where Septi lives. Well, not lives, but where he is at the minute. Um, I'm joking. I've got no idea where that is. Yeah, which hotel is that? Which room number? Um, yeah, Michael, it, it had its moment. It's, it's reconnected and it's turned blue again, so... <laughs> I've had the keyboard about coming up to two years now. It was over two years ago I spilt stuff on my keyboard. That's pretty impressive. Um, that's an ATR. What? Oh. I, it looked like a helicopter from a distance. See, this looks good. Salmon looks good. Or... Gravade Yaks is what you've called it. It's basically salmon. Hi, Aviation Tray. Good evening. How are you? Hello. Yeah, and Tech, I bet it doesn't break, mate. I bet it doesn't break. Do you eat salmon? No. Too expensive. Uh, do, do Salmon is amazing, yeah. I've never had it. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Brilliant. 
it looks good. I've never had salmon though. Never had it. Too expensive. Sorry, how much was your number plate? A three grand. Oh. But I'd much rather, you know, something like salmon, when you buy it, the money's gone. With a number plate, when you buy it, the money's gone. My point doesn't really validate itself. Um, but how? I haven't lived, chat. Blame my parents. Don't you can't blame me for that. You got you got to blame my parents. Uh, they they don't serve me up salmon. Okay, let me get that straight. Salmon is too expensive, but you spend forty quid on fudge at Silverstone. What? Stop outing me, Michael. Who would who would ever spend forty British pounds on some fudge? Who 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 are you talking about? You're getting the streamers confused, Michael. Wouldn't be me. Wait, it wasn't on purpose, Michael. There was a fudge fan at Silverstone for the Formula One, and I filled up a bag, and I was like, oh, this will only be 10, 15 quid. Got to the till, and it was 40 quid. And it's kind of like, well, it's too awkward to put the fudge back, isn't it? You may as well just spend the money. <sighs> Please do, Cameron. Thank you. You'd walk away. I would have put it back. That's a scam. Yeah, but I'm not like that. It's, it serves me right for putting so much in the bag. <laughs> That's the marketing genius, Alec. Exactly. That's how they get you spending all your money. Um, Chat, we're almost in Chile or Argentina. I don't know which one yet. Half of the river's Argentina, half of the river's Chile in a minute. Oh, F that, I'd walk away. I didn't, but yeah, I should have done. Should have done. Oh, chat. Uh, Twitch um, wrapped is tomorrow. Please share your Twitch wraps with me or chip, chip, Twitch chips wrapped. What? Twitch wrapped. Fourth time lucky. Um, I want to know if I'm your number one streamer. I better be. I better be. Chips wrapped. Twitch wrapped. <laughs> Complains about price of salmon yet spends one hundred and twenty-three no, pounds on McDonald's stop. in a month. Stop. 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 I know, I don't know who would spend 123 British pounds on McDonald's in a month. Wouldn't be me. Oh, wait. Uh, <laughs> someone hungry. I'm very hungry, yes. I, I can't keep thinking about food. Um, chip wrap with salmon. Yeah, that sounds like a good dinner. Chip wrap with salmon. Um, I think I have most the most Kenko hours this year next to stream elements. Do you reckon, Michael? Can everyone do exclamation mark watch time in the chat? I want to see who has the most amount of watch time on my channel. Baby, hear me tonight. One day, seven hours. I bet I'm going to beat all of you. Oh, yeah, I've just realized that we need to un I need to unalive the command. I don't know how to, though. Cameron, one... Uh, sorry, Callum, one month, 17 days. I've spent five months. Eight days, one day, 27 days, one day, two months. Kevin! That's ridiculous. I mean, to be fair, Michael, you've got half of Kevin's watch time, but you've only been here like half the time. JNLN spent over a month as well. 18 days is very strong still. One day, 11 hours. 14 days, 29 days, one month. Free. Rev Rentan spent three months and three days watching. Right, Rev's taken the crown. Holy crap, Rev. That's impressive. Josh has spent 22 days. That's poor. I'm joking. That, that's a month of your life you're never getting back, Josh. Holy crap. Uh, right, okay. I'll, I'll stop mentioning watch time now because that's a lot of watch times. Okay, who's been following me for the longest? Round two. Commence. Exclamation mark follow age. I don't, I don't I don't spend time here because I don't like you.
card, you know, you guys can buy what you want. $24.99. Why do you have a Master Caution? Uh, cabin High Out is what it's saying. Ah, yes, we never turned the packs on. Hmm. That, that, that's a little bit of an issue. Let's just sort of hide the evidence. The door's not closing. Oops. <laughs> Rep. Exit, uh, can we get uh, 90 people? There's 86 of you and four more people. Exclamation box salmon. I'm sending you a gift card for a 24.99 pound any buzz gift card. I'm going to roll it in 10 seconds. Whoever wins gets it immediately, providing you uh, have an any buzz account. Do, do, do. Can you sorted the views? No. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I've been wrapping up Christmas presents all day. Sorry. Right. Chat. 88. Two more people. Exclamation mark salmon. One more person. Yeah. Right. Let's go. Good luck, everybody. Five, four, three, two, one. Pound. 24 pound 99. I don't scam you with euros. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. 23 of you in. The winner is Luke. LB Shush. He's always in the chat. Luke, congratulations. You've just won a £25 Anybody's gift card. Who wants to do another one? <laughs> uh, right, whispers. Oh, I've just pasted in the... More! Wasn't expecting that. Ha ha ha. No way. You're welcome, mate. Always goes to the best of us, Luke. Genuinely. Always goes to the best of us. Uh, check your Twitch whispers. Any card. Smiley face. There you go. Right, that one's been sent. Let's buy another one. Do 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 do. Right, right, this one might not be twenty five pound though. <laughs> I don't know. Chat, I'm addicted to spending money. Help, Crutcher. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Uh, what should we do this one on? Eighty four, eighty three, ninety nine. Uh, yeah, in your dreams. Um. For sixteen ninety nine. I can't do euros. It's got to be pounds. Let me just copy something else, and so Luke's card isn't copied or stolen. There we go. Gift card dingy. Oh my god, Nick! He's ho Nick's hoping for this win. Nick's really hoping. Enough for what? Enough for Innsbruck. Another okay, drive. sixteen ninety nine it is then. This one won't be as much because, I mean, the bank only stretches so far. Um, I'm literally going to be at a loss today, but it doesn't matter because I love you guys so much. Right. Uh, £16.99. Going once, going twice, going three times. I have the gift card. Let's, uh... Whoa. The heck? Nick, that's a massive 500 bit chair. What the hell? Huh? How? Oh, he only does it a small one. Well, how come stream moments is massive? Oh, bre <laughs> what? I'm so confused. How? What? I think it's emojis, like on your phone. No, chat. Don't don't do exclamation mark salmon. Um, I think we need to... I'm going to clear these entries. We're going to do a new word. I'm waiting for someone to put the eggplant. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Rev, great minds think alike. Uh, right, hang on. Let's do exclamation mark settings. <laughs> the timing was perfect. Um, exclamation mark. Uh, <laughs> Kevin added block term eggplant emoji. <laughs> There's the peach. Um, exclamation mark penguin. Uh, P E N G U I N. Exclamation mark penguin for your chance to win a £16.99p Innybuilds gift card. Um, if you are, by the way, Luke, if you're still here, if, when you, if you want to spend your gift card, please can use my affiliate link. If you are spending money with these gift cards, please use my, my Innybuilds link because then I get a rebate on the money I've just spent. Thank you. <laughs> I'm such a troll, but it's true. All right, exclamation mark penguin. Yes, one of these. Lots of these. The jo Josh's Josh's message just doesn't end in penguins. <laughs> there you go, Josh. You definitely copy and pasted that from the title, though. You're lazy. Um, did you buy them with your link? Uh, no, I didn't. I don't think I'm allowed to, Nick. Thank you for a thousand bits, by the way. Um, yeah, I I didn't buy the gift cards through my link. No, that seems a little bit. 
That, that, that doesn't feel right if I did that, to be fair. How dare you? Sorry. Right, we're going to roll this in a minute. Chat, this is the last one because we do need to... Well, we've just overflown the airport we're landing at, no? Where are we landing? Where's the airport? We're landing soon. Uh, I need to continue to send a little bit quicker than we are, though. We might need to hold a minute, but that's okay. This sounds too intelligent for Ian. Yeah, it does sound a bit weird, actually. Da -na 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 -na. 101 people? The word must have got around that we're doing giveaways. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love it. Mm -mm. Ba -na 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 -bam -ba. Right. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Exclamation mark. Penguin. More like penguin. Penguin. Peng. Penguin. Nice one. Uh, we'll do land rate predictions as well. Chat, you're entering for a £16.99p in Evil's gift card. I think it's enough to get you some sort of scenery. Um, I'll give you five minutes on the land rate prediction as well. Good luck, everybody. Five, four, three, two, one. The winner of the gift card goes to Ben J W R I. Followed me for over four years. Couldn't have gone to a better person. Congratulations, Ben. If you are here, say something, and I will drop you a Twitch whisper with the Inbills gift card. Well done. Let's go. Boom, boom. Nah, rigged, rigged. It's always rigged. GG's in the chat, please. GG's in the chat. Hi, let's go. Damn. I presume you have Flight Sim and you have an Indie Buzz account, right? Regardless, you're getting the code anyway. Um, B E N J W R I. Let's go. Well done, mate. Is it the picture of the blue plane? It is the picture of the blue plane. Do 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 do. Right, you've got a Twitch whisper right now of Nibio's gift card. Congratulations. Well done. There you go. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Well done, everybody. I've just spent forty British pounds on you. Thank me later. <laughs> uh, I love you. You're amazing. Um, I'm not doing an 84, but no, I, I'm sorry. I, 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 my bank cannot stretch to do an 85 pound any bills. Get, I, I'm not, you know, my bank's not infinite, unfortunately. I'd love it to be, but uh, no, no. 200, Josh, if you're willing to sponsor the giveaway, pay up. <laughs> I, I would happily do a 200 pound any bills gift card giveaway, but uh, sorry. I don't know why the emoji's massive. I've got no idea. You don't love us much then, Ian, clearly. <laughs> Troll. 6,581's here. Hi. Oh, I thought my bank was unlimited. Yeah, I wish it was. Oh, my God. Right, yeah. I don't, I don't, know, if, I don't know if you guys saw this or whether anybody, right? Um, look at this. Chat. Do you know we're going to... Do you know I'm going to FS Weekend in Netherlands at the hotel in Lelstead? I've booked twice. So, I booked one reservation, and they didn't take the money. So, I was like, oh, okay. I'll book again. <laughs> um, and now I'm f***ed because the one that I booked had no cancellations. So, I don't know what to do because I can't cancel these reservations. I've sent them an email, but when I... I can't rev because they speak, like, Netherlandish. I can't... I can't... from um hi grizzle <laughs> you've just missed some mini you've just missed some mini builds giveaways and some skill issues um we've booked twice to go to lowstead and i've booked two different rooms so the, there's a high chance if i don't get it cancelled i've got to pay for two rooms when there's only one of me um so if anyone's going to fs weekend and want a spare room to themselves I might be paying too because the book, the one that I booked has no cancellations. So that's 800 euros out of the window. Um, thank you very much, Grizzle, for 118 viewers. Welcome in, everybody. We're just landing into the southernmost part of the world. Um, I don't know where the airport is. I've got absolutely no idea. But uh, we will be landing very soon. And the sim looks gorgeous. 400 euros for three nights. Uh, and I booked it twice. Although I was only charged for one of them. So I'm only 400 euros down at the moment. It's calm. Three nights, 400 euros. But obviously I booked it twice, so 800 euros. But yeah. You never know. You never know. There might be a, there might be a Mrs. Hanmore by, by March, so yeah. I'm just planning. I'm just planning ahead. This is what it is, 
Room giveaway, yeah. Lel's Dead FS Weekend Hotel Room Giveaway. Who wants to win? Um, that's ridiculously expensive. Really? 400 euros. That's not even including breakfast, because I noticed there was a KFC and McDonald's literally opposite the hotel. So I was like, that's that's the morning sorted. So I didn't bother with breakfast. Um, you got scammed. Well, if you, uh, Three nights? It's like 100 and... 130 euros a night. That's about normal. How is that? How have I been scammed? Yeah, it's not that expensive. My 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 like apartment room in London was like 180 pound for one for one night. Sounds expensive for the shithole that Lel said is. Oh, okay. Do, Ian, you're on holiday. Don't you dare go to Mac. I've got to try Mackey's in Netherlands. It's probably totally different. Why are you going for McDonald's if you're in a hotel? Because who would eat hotel food? Uh, I'm joking. Josh, good afternoon. How are you? Hello, well, mate. Well, what is that? Hello, mate. Welcome. Um, oh, no, we're just circling for the minute. I think the airport. There's the. Ah, that's where we're landing. That that is the southernmost airport in the world. I've just realised how we, how distracted we are right now. Um, what does that mean? I'm not normal, chat. Let's be real here. Um, 130 euros, 100, yeah. 107 pound for, for, so yeah, I, I paid 170 pound, 107 pound a night, which is good. I don't think that's too bad. Um, hotel food will be proper food, yeah. It's not for me then, is it? Um, okay, well may, maybe, it's not saying I can't eat at the hotel, obviously I can, but I'll have to be paying for it though. Um, we will do a visual approach, we just gotta probably do one more hold here, one more hold here. Um, we never assumed you, you was normal, Ian. Don't worry, it's fine. It's all good. Is there like a swimming pool and stuff? Don't be silly. I don't know. I haven't looked at the facilities. I'll be honest. If the, if there's a gym, I'm obviously going to the gym. Uh, if there's a swimming pool, I'm obviously getting my swimming trunks on. Uh, if there's... What else do you get at a hotel? I don't even know. Mate, I, I'm not using any of the facilities. I literally go, use the hotel for the room and that's it. Like, I know I pay for all these facilities and, like, free spa treatments and stuff and saunas or whatever. I literally go into my room, I sleep, I wake up and I leave the hotel room. It's all I want. And I'm happy. Um, that's Cap, I know. It, it was Cap, yes. I've never been to a gym in my life, chat. Um, I agree. Yeah, I, I don't see what what else would you do in a hotel. I mean, it's in Lelstead of all places. Like, it's, it's not quite your, your Las Vegas Luxor, is it, you know? Or Mandalay Bay or MGM Grand like that. That them hotels are a little bit different, little bit different. Uh, they they do have a smoking shelter. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, you know, yeah. With all that vaping that I do. Yeah. Why do you keep saying Lelstead? I don't know. How do you pronounce it? Laystead. Ian, stop getting your hopes up because the definition of a hotel is a room with a bed and a bathroom in, and sometimes a TV if you're lucky. Yeah, the hotel room that I've got though, Josh, has a TV that kind of like expands out of the like the end of the bed that's where like 20 quid's gone into for sure oh yeah and a chair and a dresser you might get a mirror as well there's right if you notice this there's so many mirrors in hotel rooms why is that like i genuinely like I, i've stayed in a lot of hotels in the uk and nearly every single one of them that i've stayed in at has literally had like 50 mirrors a two-way mirror don't say that um, is there a room? The room feels bigger. No, not on the ceiling, no. Hidden cameras. So they hide the cameras. Nah. They would never do that. Um, I bet, I bet there is some hotels that have that, though. Or you, like, as in, not, as in, like, there has been some dodgy people staying at hotels and put some stuff, like, behind certain things. That's just weird, though. Um, did you walk in and get scared because there was someone else in the room? Yes, I did, Josh, yeah. No, that's me. Um, no, of course I didn't. Um, there's always people on TikTok showing how, how to spot them. I think I've seen one or two TikToks about that, yeah. It's the staff doing it. Well, they should be sacked. They need to go, they need to go behind bars. Um, I saw a sus uh, in hotel in Vegas on TikTok the other day. Really? What? Thank you for the follow. Be uh, Brelar Gaming and Context Switch. Congratulations to Grain, Ben and Luke for the giveaway winners as well. Uh, hotel staff already work behind bars. Do you count yourself as a bit of a, a comedian? The class clown, Josh. I'm joking, that was quite funny. Um, 
Oh, that's it, Woodlog. Exactly. That's how I'm going to find Mrs. Hanmore. You know it. Uh, behind bars, why are you trying to reform with the pub work? Yeah, there you go. Your Callum's on it as well. Uh, right, speed now. Pretty so you minutes to go 180. I don't know where the Bluger in this uh, A3, A310 is, by the way. I need to have a look. I need to have a look. Uh, right, 180. Um... <coughs> what am I doing? What am I doing? So, we need to come in from the other direction. I think we're landing runway... We're landing runway 26, so yeah, we'll, we'll carry on down the river. We're basically on the border, so where we are... Oh, gosh, we've, we've overcooked that a bit too much. Um, this river here, chat, so pretty much draw a line in the middle. This is Chile, this is Argentina, um, and the airport is somewhere over here. So we're going to pretty much take it visual and then fly into the runway. Uh, I just don't know where the airport is, but we'll figure it out. Um, oh, Luke, 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 Luke. Luke, 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 Luke. Ah! Uh, I don't. Uh, I've got to buy you another one now. <laughs> Fuck sake! <laughs> there goes another twenty-five pound of my money. Oh, it's okay, Luke. Mistakes happen. Uh, please tell me you've already spent it. Uh, the problem is, you say hopefully no one saw it. Anyone who's got better TTV or 7TV has got message history. So even though I've removed the message, they can still see the message. Already used it. Tell me the truth, Luke. Did you use it or not? Uh, exactly. Michael still sees the code as well. Yeah. It's, uh... <sighs> it's okay. That's why I, I always, whenever I copy codes, I always just try and copy something in like the header or something. What is 7TV? It adds like emotes like this, like the, the little icon and stuff like that. It just adds like a whole plethora of new emotes and stuff. Um, and airport traffic, DAP 2-0. Uh, we have, well, we're overflying, well, we can see the airport now. Uh, the southernmost airport in the world. Uh, we're going to be circling in visually uh, for a landing on runway uh, 26, airport traffic. I don't know where we are. But, you know, there's not many people around me, so airport traffic is good enough. Uh, I got myself IB for Luke. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Not a nice try plan, so copying the format of the Inni builds codes. Nice one. Right, down to 2,000 okay, feet. Traffic, the southern most airport in the world traffic. <laughs> Mikowski 5-4 is vacating on Susie Nice. Thank you for the troll, mate. I appreciate that very much. Um, uh, I know these uh, chaps and chiplets be trying to use a dead code. That's fine. If they try and use it, it should say there's no money left on it anyway, so it's fine. Uh, Ian, uh, can you land and barter quickly? I need to sleep before my exam tomorrow, but I've got a gambling addiction, so I can't go before I know I've won or not. What on the... Oh, we're beeping. What do you mean? On the landing rate prediction, you've got a gambling addiction. Oh, no. You sound like me in my younger years on CSGO. No, it's fine. We're, we're going to land, I promise. We just had a little... Uh, had a little circle to get ourselves down. And um, we'll loop in behind PAA 54. That's Rev Rentan. So we'll let Rev land and then we'll loop in behind Rev. There he is. We got Vigila Rev. Massive, massive thing. There you go. Ian makes children bet. Yes. I encourage online children gambling. No, I, I do not. That's Twitch. That's not me. Um... Blue Rat says he'll land last. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Uh, collapse. No, please don't clip that. That's my Twitch career over. Um, no, I do not condone any sort of underage uh, gambling on said channel. No. Only gamble at your own risk. And when the fun stops, start back up again. Uh, remember, kids, 99% of gamblers quit before they win big. Don't be them. Be the 0.1%. Continue to gamble. If you've lost $50, put $50 back in. You might win $100, then you got your money back. <laughs> Yay. Uh, the biggest win I've ever had on gambling was in Vegas, and it was like 100 and... No, it was more. It was like $350, I think. I bet like $5 and won like 300 and something. I was, I was, I was buzzing. 
absolutely buzzing. Although I think I bet about $300 to get that win. You know what I mean? So I, I wasn't really up. But, um, you know, casinos like to make you to think that you've won big when all you've done is break even. Um, bye, Nutrient, if you're heading out. Bye. I'm not addicted. I can stop whenever I want. Good. That's really good brain control. Brain control, self-control. I don't know. Uh, Ian, are you live right now at Kenko? Hi, Clipsy. Rev, good luck with your landing. I'm going to take it visual. Beep, beep, beep. Poo for sure. We're only just talking about gambling. Hi. It's as if your ears went red. Taking it visual. Yeah, we have visual. The runway's here. Right there. Ian, smile. Ian. Poof. Guys, can we get some love in the chat for the man, the myth, the legend, Pooh for sure, with his, like, three million YouTube subscribers? I hope I haven't undercut you there. I wonder if you... Have you got more than three million now? I don't know. I want to play Mario Kart with you, Pooh for sure. Thank you very much, your 27-month Switch Prime. I hope you are well. Less than three million. What? One thousand. It's fine. What, what You're worth more count? than three I million to me, mate. Don't you worry. What's his YouTube? Poo for sure. He does, uh, he does loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of, like, uh, retro Wii games, and he's hilarious with them. I think you're doing a series right now, Poof, aren't you? Where you're going back through all of, like, the Wii Sport Resort games. Um, and you recently done, uh, I forgot what game it was. I paid that much attention. I'm not sure, but you recently done sort of like, it was it tennis? No, not tennis. You recently done some, something like that. You'll have a quadrillion to me. Oh, the Riz. The Riz. And airport traffic, uh, some of the most airport in the world. DAP 2-0. We are on now a 10 mile final runway to, uh, eight, seven. I don't know. Ian, be careful. There are trees on the runway. Are there? Oh. I didn't test the airport, Rev, I'll be honest. Uh-oh. I love both the Wii Sports game. I loved... If you, ever, if you ever played Wii Sport Resort... Look at this sun. This is real time, by the way. Uh, Wii Sport Resort, where you could fly the plane around the island, and you had to collect, like, little balloons and, and stuff like that. So good. So good. Right, we're perfectly fine. We're a little bit high on the speed, actually. We'll go pretty much minimum. Gears down, full flaps. This is what we're flying today. Antarctic Airways. My first Avro RJ landing in MSS 2024. Rev's just vacating the runway. Look at that for timing. Rev said there's a tree on the runway, so be careful. So we'll see what we can do. I've never been more south in my life. Um, the getting 309 on a Wii Sports baseball video is probably my favorite thing ever. Oh, there you go. You've got a number one fan in the chat, Pooh, for sure. Oh, shit, there's the tree. Uh-oh. Have you ever got uh, the maximum score in Wii Bowling, Pooh, for sure? Because I feel like that's very difficult to get. There's the trees. Oh, my God, there's going to be no... St uh, rev. Uh, we'll be okay. You got it twice in a row. Oh. That's impressive. Minimum. You are impressive. Come on. I can't land. I don't like these planes. Never have, never will. Trees! 100. Oh, I've cooked this. 50. Oh, that's a go-around. 40. 30. Yeah. I don't like 146s. Gear up. Flap 15. We're going to have to do a little circle in the sky. Um, southern most airport traffic in the world. DAP 20. Unfortunately, we're going around. Uh, we'll continue climb out and we'll do the go around procedure. Whatever that may be. Um, we stalled it. That is a big go around. The thing is, steep approach certified here. Maybe use that to your advantage. Okay, we'll use it to our advantage. We'll, we'll do a little. We'll, we'll ignore the missed approach. We'll have a look where Blue Rat is. So Blue Rat is here. Okay, can we, do you reckon we got a time for a go? Oh my god, sorry, I was paying more attention to Valanta. Um, that was too slow. Okay, okay, that's fine. I don't know how Navigo have charts of this airport, Anthony. I genuinely don't know. What the heck are you doing? Uh, I'm doing a go-around procedure. I didn't mean to turn. I did. I didn't mean to turn that steeply. It's just I was on Valanta. Um, 
I will continue by holding for you. You're an amazing human being. Thank you very much. And uh, some most airport traffic in the world, DAP20. We're going to be on the downwind here for runway 28. Um, and we'll turn for base and final in just a moment. Southernmost airport traffic in the world traffic. <laughs> uh, it has got a name, but uh, I don't know what the name of the airport is. Um, but there we go. Uh, procedure, yes. Speed. There we go. Oh, local q &H would be beneficial as well. 1002. There we go. Yeah, that was certainly an interesting attempt at landing. Southernmost airport traffic in the world traffic. Traffic. Chat, I am soaked after the water ride at Universal. Adam, I am the most jealous human being right now. What, what, I, what I would do to be at Universal right now. On, like, the water slides and everything. Jeez, man. Why are you in the chat? Go and enjoy yourself. Go and have some fun. I know you're having fun, but... Oh, I'm very jealous. I need a holiday. I need, I need a sun holiday. Uh, me who lives in Florida, yeah. You lot are very lucky. Also, chat, I, I bet you didn't know this. You know, like, Disneyland and Disney World? Disney World is in Orlando because ORD's in, the, in Disney World. Disneyland's in LA because LA's in the, in the title. Bet you didn't know that. So, Disney World's Orlando because it's got Ord in it. Disneyland is in LA because it's got and in it. Or oh, ORL, sorry, yeah, not ORD, ORL. Disneyland is not in LA. It's in Anah Anaheim. But it's near LA, is it not? It's a coincidence. Is it? Hmm. I bet they, they must have planned that. Disney, no, Disneyland Paris, Lucas. So Paris is still in the name of Disneyland. It has Canada Fly Guy. <laughs> I'm glad you've noticed. It's been all over my TikTok. I just wanted to look a little I just wanted to look smart and now I feel like I'm not smart because everyone's saying that that's not how it works. Um definitely some yeah, it was TikTok. Um uh, what the hell are you doing, Simon? We're landing into the southernmost airport in the world, Southern Airport. World. Anaheim isn't even in LA County. I don't even think it's in Orange County. Oh. Okay. Never mind then. Disregard everything I've just said. Disney World Chicago. Too low. Gear. Flaps. Gear. I'm talking to you guys way too much. And southernmost airport traffic in the world. South traffic. Uh, Duff two zero. We are on short final now. Runway two eight. Steep, steep descent right in. Steep descent right in. Too low. Gear. Lunch now. Adam, have a fantastic holiday, mate. Enjoy the rest of your day. It's nine oh six here right now. Hope you have fun. Chat, we can always send it down the road if you want and land at the other airport. Because this airport, there ain't much to do here. I might do a touch and go. Minimum. Should I do a touch and go? I'm going to do a touch and go. 120. Oh, God. Nope, I've really messed that up again. I don't like this plane. Are we too quick? 10. Right, that's the touch, and now we go. We're going to Ushi. Yeah, 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 yeah. That will count on the landing rate prediction. There'll be multiple landing rates. Or just one. And it was under 200 feet per minute. Hmm. That doesn't feel right. You ditched Rev. Yeah, I know. That's all part of the plan. <laughs> Bye, Rev. No, Rev, there's nothing to do at the airport. It's boring. Rev, get your engine started, mate. We're off. Come on. Yep, exactly. Don't Bye. Sink. You've never won, Aaron. Don't yeah, sink. you're about to lose again. Um, it was under. Boom. 420 what thousand points? That is misleading. Sorry. The airport down the road is so much more fun. We're going here now. We're going to a place called Malvinas Argentinas. S-A-W-H. It's going to have to be visual, though. Canada! Uh, I'm not sure. Yes, we got three tons. Thank you for checking in, though, because I kind of forgot. Um, Mango just won a lot of points. Uh, I reckon that 180 feet per minute was the gear decompressing back through the... <laughs> You're probably right, Josh, yes. 
Probably. Flap zero. Mm. We need to go onto the other side of the water here now. Uh, Husky Simmer, thank you for the follow. Uh, wait, hang on. That Wait, hang on. No rev. I do remember one six now. Um, what's the iCal for this airport? S-A-W-H. This actually has scenery, by the way. This is a lot more fun. Ah, yes. I forgot. Runway 16 is not on the charts, but it does exist. It's like up here or something like that, isn't it? Or through here. And it's a funky, like... It's a really fun approach, because you have to, like fly like all like this it's a very difficult approach Jim. we crashed last time we did it flashback oh wow we're at 5,000 feet we climbed a bit quick um get funky with me plans oh a up uh who has got this problem where the mixture keeps being reset at a higher precision than in what in career mode double i my mixture mode doesn't reset on career mode Get funky with me. That's a song, now, is it? Funky with me. Oh, it is a song. Never heard it in my life. How are we going 300 knots? We've done a touch and go, Alfie. This is a very vibe. This is a vibe. Now, in real life, this plane wouldn't go here because it's in Argentina. And Argentina and Chile don't get along. So. Fiend, fiend, fiend. Funkypigeon.com. Uh, Dwarfy. It's gotta be this. It's like 50, 60 quid. Thrustmaster something or other. Predictions are open again. One day, Josh, or day one. Quote of the day. Do do. What boom arm do you have? A road one. It's old. I don't know. Do do do. Hi, Cohen. Sorry I done a touch and go and left you guys, but we still we still got to the southernmost airport in the world. Here's the airport we're actually landing at. Although the airport the runway's over here though. 250 quid, that's because you get this with it as well, and that's Captain Pack. I'd say it's worth it though. I dunno. I'm not sponsored by Frostmaster, so I can say what I like, but Although they did give me this for free. So is that being sponsored? Mm, not sure. I love it, but yeah. It's a lot of money. What 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 are we guessing, Cohen? Your I don't know. Didn't you have a driving lesson today, Cohen? I might have been lurking in your stream yesterday. Do do do. Hopefully that went well. I know more about you than uh, you expected. <laughs> well done. Yeah, it's fine. I was lurking. I didn't say hi, but I uh I was lurking away. Wow. Sorry, I'll say hi next time. Right, if, uh, we're going literally idle on the engines. God, this song's and this song's long. It just, keep, it just keeps going on. Um, yes, Cohen, Cohen Hughes underscore is a streamer. Is a streamer. Right. Uh, and second most southern airport traffic in the world, DAP20. We're we'll landing runway 16. Uh, we're going to be flying over the city for the circling approach to runway 16. Uh, second most airport, southern most airport traffic in the world traffic. What? He went to um, you can't escape the beluga, and I can't. Second most, southernmost airport, southern Three second in the ahead. world. Pull up. We need to be low. Right, by the way, I've done this before. If you're wondering what the hell I'm doing, I've done this approach before. It only failed in a Boeing 737 because we ran out of fuel. It's the only reason it failed. This time round, I think we, we got this under control. Gear down, flaps. Watch and learn, boys. And yes, we only ran out of fuel because I failed the approach four times. We're flying over the Mercedes-Benz dealer because I remember speaking about if this place has cars and where they buy their cars and if they're being imported. 
But uh, they have a Mercedes-Benz dealership somewhere down here. Fact of the day. The airport's here. We need to be low. Low and slow. Low and slow. Low and slow. But not too slow, because that's where your stalling happens. It's like here. I think it's like here. Oh, this, this is flashbacks, chap. This is flashbacks. be a sharp turn hmm. I can't really descend too much more I really want to I miss I'm so missing Toby head tracking man I miss it so much yeah it's not that's it Rev exactly them words is what I said exactly them words speed's good altitude's good we'll start making that turn about now and second most southernmost airport in the world Green, we're just turning uh, up Stand by. Sorry, is it what? What's the saying? Aviate before you communicate. <laughs> We're good. Don't worry. And second most traffic traffic in the world. Uh, we are short final. Bailey? I don't know. Because it's a different airport. Yeah, but it's not registered on Flight Sim, though. You're like, you can't spawn here. I'm sorry, who architectured? It's like, it's like putting Gatwick and Heathrow a mile away from each other. Oh, there's an airport here. Let's build another one here because there isn't one that's built here. Doesn't make sense. It's the old... Okay, now it makes sense. It's the old airport. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh. I mean, that's quite something, Bailey. That is quite something. 
And he's also overrunning. Oh no, he's not going to. Damn it. Well done, Bailey. As you can see, there's a, a certain penguin. Oh, Sim's freezing. Boom. Nailed it. Uh, chat, we got a beluga coming in in a minute. Where's the beluga, actually? He's only miles away. There's the beluga. I think he's done a touch and go as... Oh, my God. The beluga's been all over the place. Boom. I think Rev might have gave up. I think Rev... Did, Rev, are you on your way or did you give up? Uh, they built a new one because of the crashes. Because of me, basically. Let's get to stand. We'll get to stand. We'll get to stand. Uh, the approach is a bit challenging. You can tell me. Southern Airport, no traffic. Oh, Southern Rev says traffic. wait for me. Southern okay. Traffic. traffic. is vacated from the Right, Bailey. I want to see you ramp this. But at the same time... Oh, my God. Let's get out of that. Let's uh, let's get to, let's get ourselves to airport. Let, let's get deboarding. Rev's giving up. Never. Uh, chat. I don't know if this is possible. I am MS Fest 2020 out. Are you, Michael? I know your pain. Boom. I'm talking about you. What do you mean? I am 2020 doubt. Forget it. I'm confused. There's no way to get to the other airport, by the way, other than this. Exclamation mark, Ken Cog. Fernando, thank you very much for 20 months, tier 1. This is going to have to be a slew job, isn't it? Yeah, we'll, we'll slew it onto the, onto the highway. Oh! He's managed to do it. Hi, Bailey. Cheating. Um, we're going to have to go through the security gate. And go and hand over our, um, lanyard. Rev and the Beluga, let me know when you're on final. We're just gonna have to sort of skedaddle through here like nothing's happened. Perfect. Can you ramp it? Uh, we tried earlier. We tried ramping a big one. It kind of worked. Oh, there's no jetways. Visuals look stunning. Some Star Trek theme song or something. Uh, we'll go to a jetway stand, but I don't have a jetway, so. I'm on short final now, Rev. Okay. Hang on. Perfect. Well, we got to stand. That's all that matters. Do, 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 do. Perfect. Stop. Parking brake. Uh, and we'll shut down. Two, three, four, three, two, one. Boom. We might have just killed the plane. What is this song? This kind of works, actually, whatever song this is. Rev, where are you? Rev, are you sure you're connected to the network? Because I can't see you. Four miles out. I feel like I'm an actor in a film right now. Pooh for sure with the festive hat. Beautiful surroundings. This sim looks very nice right now, yes. We're in the, we're in the southernmost part of the world, like, people-wise. That's my city? No way! Have we got someone tuning in from here? You're joking. Do you live in... Oosh... Hang on, let me get this right. Do you live in... Ush, you -E -A -A That's sick. I'm shocked. Yes. 
What? What are we listening to? I don't know. It's some sort of intense music. Um, mate, first and foremost, welcome into the stream. It's a pleasure to have you here. Um, do you have Mercedes-Benz dealerships? <laughs> uh, that's actually insane. Mate, we love this part of the world because it's so difficult to fly into it. It's so much fun. That's so cool. Beautiful city. It is beautiful. Rev, we still can't see you, mate. Are you sure you're definitely connected to the network? Because you're in quite a big plane and I can't see a big plane on final. Uh, no way they have Wi-Fi. Shush. <laughs> it's amazing you have caused an international incident. I have. That is true. That is actually true. What's the town called? Ush yeah. Can't pronounce it. There. Can you see him? Rev? Ush yeah, 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 yeah. Heading off, Craig. Have a great evening. Bye bye. Craig, I would have sorted out your LinkedIn thing this morning, but my LinkedIn account got hacked, so I haven't got a uh, I can't like it. I need to set up another LinkedIn account. Because I'm currently Anna Lynn from somewhere. Oh, there's the beluga. West, west. I can only see the beluga. Yeah, Lucas, I know. I don't know how my LinkedIn got hacked, okay? I've got no idea. I managed to change gender and change, like, ethnicity and everything. But I, uh, I apparently still work for the company that I used to work for, so I don't really know what they think of it, but never mind. I can't see anyone. One mile final now. Be right back. No worries. Good luck, Rev. Uh, well, I technically work for Twitch. Doesn't really make sense, but, yeah. Rev's probably trolling. No, I don't think he is. I wouldn't say he is. I mean, my eyes are on this guy at the moment. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, to be fair, lol, Fred. To be fair. I found a super tiny runway in Florida, posted it in Discord, Carpenter. Wait, Rev, are you actually trolling? Mate, if you are trolling, I have... I've been baited. Heavily. Where did you post it, Carpenter? Oh, there. Oh, my God. Why is that runway so skinny? Thanks. No, I'm taxiing. Did you miss me? 10 out of 10. What?! How have you guys seen Rev Lamb? But I haven't. He's definitely not here. Ian, I landed at SAHW. SAWH, not SAWO, for fuck's sake. Oh. No, because I can't see you at the other airport, Rev. I saw you in... Okay. Let's watch the beluga land into the middle of nowhere. Whoever you are, I wish you the best of luck because I, I found this impossible in an Avro RJ... Um, I have a lot of respect for you for flying that into this airport. Good luck. Doom. What is this song, bro? This dude. Prey. He's number four. He's the fourth beluga whale coming in. Not the fourth, you know what I mean. Number four. This looks dodge. This is the center line. He's doing a good job. Steady, 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 steady. Nice. Get it down. Get it down. Get it down. He's got it down. If it, it right, if he stops in a beluga and I couldn't stop in an Avro RJ, I may as well just quit streaming. Yeah, but it's unfair because he's got reverses. I didn't have reverses. Everyone's saying bye. It's, I'm 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 not stopping streaming. Um, yeah, he had auto break as well. Exactly, Sim Race Fly. Thank you for being on my side. Right, we we got we got to watch him ramp it. 
And then, uh... It's half night. It's a bit earlier than we normally finish, but I am knackered. So, oh my god, what? Look at the water. That looks dodge. Blabbering. That is what he's doing. Nice knowing you, and yeah, bye, Zach. He landed where you're supposed. He did land where he's supposed to. Yeah, I did land halfway down the runway. He also weighs significantly more. It yeah. Oh, what? What? What the? Buddy's got two wings. I'm not so sure that should be part of the beluga. What? Uh, I'm so confused. Maybe that's... Uh, hmm. That's normal, is it? Yeah? Oh, no. <laughs> How did you do that so elegantly? <laughs> uh, I'm just honestly... Uh, yeah. Why is there a blue go on the road? I don't know, mate. It's the only way to get from the actual old airport to the new airport. We just kind of paved our own road. But, uh, yeah. It's good fun. I don't know what he's carrying, but... That's where the con... That's where the chem... Ah, oh, I see. That's where the chem... The, the chem chars come out of this pipe here, yeah? He just left them out. He left them out. You could also get there via the air. True. But we didn't. Very true, though. Um, yeah, there's not really much to see in this airport, is there? Oh, what lovely interior. Beautiful. Oh, my God. Because that's not scary. Hitman? Is that you? He's got a briefcase and everything. That's, that's where you're keeping the pistol. Agent 42. Oh. I paid for this scenery. I can't... You paid? Oh, no, it's freeware. Sorry. I paid for the other one where we took off out of. Sorry, I am a prime yapper right now. Retro 70s decor. I bet this airport hasn't been updated in ages. How do they have so many cars? I won't start that again. Beautiful part of the world, though. It's very nice. So you are already west of 13, isn't Sorry? Bonjour, Lapino. How are you? Hello. Are they all Mercedes? Yeah, there's only a Mercedes dealership here, so they have to be Mercedes. There's a limo. Uh, and how do they get cars without roads? It's a very good question. They use trains. Was trains around before cars? Or was cars around before trains? Trains were around before cars, apparently. The earliest form of rail transport, wagonways, were wooden tracks that made it easier for horse-drawn carts and wagons to move along dirt roads. They were used in Germany as early as 1550. Damn. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, the wooden cart before trains. I didn't know that. How did... How do you guys know that? Ian, man. Trains first. Okay. It, it's a legit question that I've just asked Google, so... You learnt it in school. Well, I don't know what school you went to, but my school didn't teach me that. It's called basic education. We don't get that in Kent. <laughs> well, we just learn about uh, what's the thing that happened in uh, in Greece all those years ago, where like uh, they got like sand dune or. Pompeii. We learned about Pompeii in school. It's about as much as uh, I, I remember. Uh, were you taught anything? Not really, but I'm sure you can teach me loads, Poo, for sure. Kevin, thank you for 47 months with tier one. Good evening. Welcome into the stream. Hello. Uh, sand? Was it... Oh, was it ash? Was it ash? Have you ever heard of the Industrial Revolution? Only because of Sid Meier's Civilization V. 
In Back to the Future 3, they had a train, but there was no cars. Duh. Of course. Of course. Ah. Ian, yeah, next time you have a thought, please keep it to yourself. I will. I don't do myself many favours, chat, do I? Let's be real here. I'm gonna change the time of the weather. I wanna make it, I wanna make this sim look really, really nice. Rhythm as a dancer. Mate, I, 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 I got A's in GCSE, but no one believes me. I got A's in my GCSEs. Rhythm. Chat, can we go to space? Like, is there a way I can increase the, the height of, like, the speed of this drone cam and just, like, get to space? Oh my god, there might be. Oh. I'm gonna hold, I'm gonna keep holding it. Um, how much did you pay them? Who? I'm ashamed of our education system. You should be. I failed it miserably. Free cam is faster. Okay. Have you tried this then, Rev? Does it go quicker? Oh, it does. Yes. This is so much better, Rev. Yes. There you go. Your, you, yeah, my teachers, yeah. That's true. Rhythm is a dancer. It's a soul's companion. We can feel it anywhere. Chat, should we fly to Heathrow? Oh my god, we can do a game where we can... Right, someone say an airport. I'll fly to it. I don't know if, he, I don't know if free cam's going to work like that, though. Oh god, maybe not. No, maybe disregard last transmission. I think I broke it. Oh god. I'm not understanding. Simon, I'm surprised you're not controlling for vectors to Copenhagen. Chat, I can't... It's not working. I, I, my brain's not computing what the hell I've got to do here. Oh, you literally are controlling... Why are you, why are you in here, then? Is that Spain? Oh my god, chat, I found Spain. There's the UK. Bog. Lack of gravity. It says rotate... Ah! No? Rotate camera. I don't think it's possible. Maybe I can... F Maybe if you get closer, it, it sorts out the... No, I think it's because we're at the other side of the world to Argentina. It's just messed up. Maybe. I'm trying to get to Heathrow. Yeah, I'm now the International Space Station. I am. Can you tell that I'm tired? I'm going to fly to my house. I'm joking. Ooh, what a feeling. You can just rotate it. Yeah, that zooms in and zooms out, Rev. I've changed my keybinds. Tune. It is a tune. I press space and it's... Oh, look, chat, we found London Heathrow. All the way from Argentina. Would you look at that? I'm the fastest man in the world. Although I don't have any... Uh, I don't I don't have any... Uh, there's the missing terminal. Nice one, Asobo. Uh, I'm not. No, Ibanez. I am, I'm the minority. You can't see it. I don't know how to make it normal. Sorry. What if I... Can I back to briefing? Way! That's so cool. Oh, I might have broke it. These animations are pretty sick. Can't lie. Um, chat, I'm going to go to bed because I think I'm tired. I've had a long day wrapping up Christmas presents. Oh, I know. Tough day, isn't it? Um, I'll be back tomorrow. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. What do you want to do tomorrow? I hope you had fun today. It was good fun. Um, 787? Seven, seven, no, I meant 747. Seven. Or do you want to fly career mode all day? Splitstream long haul 748. Shout, to be fair, Rev. Beluga's a good one as well. Dreamliner, yeah, we can't do the, we can't do the Dreamliner. Okay, career mode or 747-8 seven, long haul. Because they've updated the interior... Of the 747, it looks very, very nice. Hmm. Finken, Weeder to Nance. Career and... I, I, I can do... 
Hmm. If we do, we can do career and 747, but it's finding a short 747 flight that will have a tr problem problem with. Plans of is it your birthday tomorrow? Happy birthday for tomorrow. Split stream Dublin to Boston and A321LR. That that's doable as well. I don't know where I don't know where Finn can worder is, Dwarfy. 787 has has a cabin now too. Oh, does it? Yeah, but the, the liveries look disgusting on it, Aiden. If you put the KLM livery and spawn on the Dreamliner, it looks minging. Um Oh Hamburg. Oh Oh my god, chat. Why don't we do Iceland Air? Hamburg to Reklavik delivering their brand new A for twenty one Neo. Just full send it. That's like a three and a half hour flight, but I don't care. Don't do Iceland Air. Delivery is so shit. Oh, is it? Oh, we have to wait for a better one then. Mm. Keflavik. I keep saying Reklavik. Keflavik. He tried it. I wanted to cry. Didn't even pay the door out. Oh, God. Right. We'll have to save that for another day then, Rev. Um. Okay. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 I still haven't done any of these. I really want to do these, but it's very difficult to find them. Um, many livery crates forgetting about the doors. I don't get it. Really? It's because it's because there hasn't been any good livery designers de developing liveries, Rev, for the for the new sim. Like we're just getting we're just getting random people on Flashing.to making liveries. It's not the same. It's not the same. Yeah. Oh, Fink and Worder is the is EDDH. That makes sense. That makes sense. Uh, Josh, have a look. Let's have a look. What's the issue with the 79? It has there has been fine for me. So, oh, really, Asmid? Okay. I mean, I I personally haven't touched it based on the screenshots I've looked at. Oh, Josh, it's so good to see you in the A380, mate. It's so good to see you in the A380. How do you get that? What? You got a little co-pilot mascot. That's so cool. That's so cool. I think people are waiting to be able to download stuff because it'll make it a lot easier. Yeah, that's understandable. That's understandable. And yeah, half the air, half the aircraft are bloody encrypted as well. It's an Easter egg. Oh, is it? Oh, do you have to like activate the Easter egg? How does this guy not know about that? I I didn't know there was a bear in the A three eighty. You have to click the pin to get it on the fire. Oh, really? Okay, I didn't know that. Click the pin on the fire extinguisher, and a little bear pops in. No one told me. That's really cool. Um, okay, I'll sleep on it. We'll see what we want to do tomorrow. There will be an evening. Uh, sorry, there should be a morning stream. Um, I'll try and make there. An, I'll try and make sure there's an evening stream as well, regardless. Um, I had fun tonight though. I, it was something I wanted to do. It was on my bucket list to fly to the southernmost airport in the world. So, I would say uh, mission com min mission success today. Yeah, career mode's one of the options for sure. For sure. Um, the sim survived as well. Obviously, we had that one little glitch. Um, but. Yeah, The Sims definitely got better as of late, which is good. And again, anyone who tuned into my St. Martin landing yesterday evening, um, thank you very much for that, because that was a bunch of fun. I really did enjoy that as well. Um, so, what do you mean, success? It was it was fun. I measure success on fun, and we had a lot of fun. Um, someone said check Discord, but uh, I'm not sure. Uh, oh, Asmid. Yeah, it looks good. I just... I don't know if I'm waiting for, like, Bravo, IV, Bravo Airspace or, like, Horizon Sim or something. We didn't do a full-stop landing and then we overran. Yeah, that's good in my books, Rev. In comparison, that's good. Um, the stream yesterday was good fun. It was good fun today as well. In the Minecraft server's down, I know. It's been down for, for many, many, many months, Aiden. Um, right, chat, I'm going to head out. I'm tiring. Have a lovely evening. Thank you all for tuning in. Thank you for the support, as always. The bits, the three subs, everything. Thank you very much. I'll see you all... Uh, tomorrow, uh, day and slash or evening, and uh, I'll see you later. There was, yeah, we had a Minecraft server over the summer period. Um, bye everybody! Hello, get it back online right now, what, for Christmas? Maybe, I'll see. We, we could get it online for Christmas, um, although I wanna, I wanna try and plan an ETS2 Christmas convoy, though, because I know that you guys love your, uh, I know that you love your, uh, your Euro truck, but we'll see. Good night, everybody. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you, Rev, for flying. Thank you, Bailey, for flying. Thank you, Blue Rat, for flying along. Um, and I'll see you all uh, later. Bye, everybody. ETS2 would be great, yeah. 
I uh, I am due a Christmas convoy, as my chat keeps telling me. So we'll see. Bye, everybody. Good night. Bye-bye. Thanks for tuning in, as always. Bye-bye.